Hey, what you doing? Oh, I'm just uh, I'm just picking up some of this plastic. We just got our uh, our martial arts pad, kicking pads, and punching pads. Very here. cool. Yeah, so uh, our little dojo here is almost complete. That's awesome. All right, so we'll get this box out of here, and uh, we'll we'll give you the nickel tour. We'll start with these lights right here. <laughs> These are our homemade lights. Homemade studio lights. Yes, and we do have to say that in addition to this being our workout space, which is part of our Ikikai, Ikikai is living your purpose, and being fit and in shape and healthy is part of our purpose, um, but it's also a place for us to record our workouts, right? Well, we already have. So. so, all right. So I confess, I, I'm like feeling reluctant about turning the camera around because this is what the whole space looked like before we made our dojo. This is our. Oh, it's dark. This is our garage. Yeah. So way. I'm gonna go this way. No, it's okay. Don't. It's, it's all good. Okay. So here's the here's the full view version the full view version of our garage our whole garage was like this clutter everywhere however it is much more organized now and the back end we thought what did we think hon about what about this back end when it was a mess and full of stuff that we we, we would never create enough space to make a dojo that's right so we got rid of a lot of junk so we have our little tripod here where this camera goes and behind all of our mead making apparatus and then we have our lovely curtain here this is the the first thing it's actually hiding our our electrical box the floor which is one of those uh interlocking mat type things that uh, we got fairly cheaply oh and there's some some arm pads joe demo demo on arm pad Demo an arm pad. Yeah, put it on your on your arm. You're gonna do something to it. No. Oh well, not with oh, the okay. camera. I'm just just saying if you put oh, it on. Okay. Yeah. So so basically, these are arm pads that you hold onto your arms when you're working with a partner for kickboxing. You look like a rock'em so, sock'em robot. Strap the other one but you know you can hold them here and so when you're working with the partner they can kick and you can hold them higher lower let's let's show your bar oh my bar well step up to the bar so this is a what they call a, a ballet bar uh, we use this for stretching Jill will in her infinite amount of flexibility Put gets so, her foot up here. Yeah, you can hold your foot up here this way. You can do a stretch this way, which is great for front kicks. So it's awesome. Marcus made this from scratch. Yeah, I actually made it with the, this is a railing that I got from Lowe's, a railing. And then these are the, the clamps. And all I did was take some, some pine wood and I cut it because it was too close. When I, when I had this part here up against the wall, the bar was too close to the wall. So I had to bring it out a little bit. And so I used that, but. Uh, and he's like attached this, it's super, super solid. And he's attached it to the wall. Yeah. Like this hard, hard brick wall. You can hang on it. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm not gonna try to well, hang on it. Try, try moving it. But I Check will it. do this. Look. I'll hang on it this way. How's that? Yeah. See, does it move? No. Not at all. Okay. And then we've got our our little bamboo things yeah, that we've, we've had, had forever. We've had those since I think Marcus's grandmother, who's long been gone for like the past 15 years maybe. Um, she got this in Chinatown in Boston. And then we got this, Marcus and I, in Chinatown in New York, because that's where we used to live, up, up north. So, yeah, and then, then I have this curtain that's, that's hiding our, 
You have to see our, our on-demand hot water heater. And so we've got these, those pads we've shown you. We've got some other exercise equipment. Uh, we've got uh, another kettlebell coming in, but the yoga mat, foam rollers, muscle massager things. And then the stuff that, that just came is the rest of our gear, our pads. Yeah, these are, these are for punches. So, so what we do is we do, uh, we're, you know, we're fitness trainers. We got certified a while back. Um, we are uh, kickboxers because we have a martial arts background, 20 plus years. We also do kettlebell workouts. So we do a lot of workouts that don't require a lot of equipment, but this is some of the stuff that we like to use. Okay, you want me to, you want me to punch one? All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit, I'm just gonna hit that one Ready? with the, with a, uh, a right cross, ready? ready. <laughs> I'm sorry, go, go again. No, go, go. no, you, go, you have go. betrayed my trust. Go, 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 go. All right, that's a hard punch. <laughs> All right. I'm not used to the pads. You know, <laughs> he and I have sparred a lot over the years, but we usually punch one another with pads, so I'm not used to that. Again, things. again, you're, you're making it seem like I'm an abusive husband. <laughs> All right. And then these guys, which are... Here, why don't you let me do one of these? What, are you going to do a hook kick, or can you, can you do a hook kick? A roundhouse. Okay. You want me to do a hook kick or a roundhouse? You can do... You can do a roundhouse. There, see it. These are nice because they get that snap sound if you hit them right. Whoops, Ooh. I missed. Just don't hit my hand with those sneakers. <laughs> and then we've got the big pad. Alrighty. And, and you know, in all seriousness, we are having fun right now. You, 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 know, you want to take this workout seriously when you're really doing it. Um, but we're just having fun. Yeah, yeah, right. We're having fun. Okay, so remember when you pulled that pad? <laughs> I won't pull this. I have to put all my weight into this. Oh, I moved the camera. I was going to try to get a, a shot here. Ready? First person. All right. One more. <laughs> All right, one more, one more. See if I can get this. <laughs> okay. All right. And then we have our meditation stuff here. Uh, a thing for doing splits. You put this on the ground. And you put your ankles in those little pieces right there. And then you pull that bar in front of you, which Jill and her well, infinite flexibility. I am not as flexible as I should be right now. But. Well, that's okay. Look at that. I can't, well, I can't get that far. And then what happens is uh, it has these other holes so that when you get more flexible, you can move the center bar mm -hmm. so you can get it further back but basically that was it cool. that's the so i just want to say one quick thing we were feeling like we had no space to work out we were feeling like we could had no place to put our stuff in this garage to use it as a dojo but we compromised because we wanted to be working out at home and we used half the garage right I want to use all the garage and get all the junk out of here. Oh, like the place we had where we lived before, we cleared out the entire garage and it was such a sacred place. But this is cool. I'm, I'm happy with it. It is. It's awesome. Hey, so if you want to be fit and agile and have a balanced mind and, you know, a life with meaning and purpose and simplify your life, do all those things that will give you extra time, be a part of what we're doing here and follow us. Yes, do the trifecta. The trifecta. Hit like, hit subscribe, 
hit that notification bell so that you'll get notified whenever we have a new video. Thanks for watching and stay safe. Stay safe.